In love, he predestined us for adoption to sonship through Jesus Christ, in accordance with his pleasure and will, to the praise of his glorious grace, which he has freely given us in the one he loves. In him, we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the riches of God's grace that he lavished on us. With all wisdom and understanding, he made known to us the mystery of his will, according to his good pleasure which he purposed in Christ, to be put into effect when the times reach their fulfillment, to bring unity to all things in heaven and on earth under Christ. In him, we were also chosen, having been predestined, according to the plan of him who works out everything in conformity with the purpose of his will in order that we who were the first to put our hope in Christ might be for the praise of his glory. And you also were included in Christ when you heard the message of truth, the gospel of your salvation, when you believed you are marked in him with a seal, the promised Holy Spirit, who is the deposit granting our inheritance until the redemption of those who are God position to the praise of his glory. This is the word of the Lord. Thank you. Thank you. 
Christ in us blessed us in the heavenly hands with every spiritual blessing in Christ. For the chose us in him before the creation of the Lord to be holy and blameless in his sight and love. He presented him as for adoption to sonship to Jesus Christ in accordance with his pleasure and love. To the place of his glorious grace, which he has freely given us in the one he loved. In him we have possession to his blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the age of God's grace that he put on us. With all the same and understanding, he made known to us the mystery of his will according to his good pleasure, which he promised in Christ to be put into effect when the time reached their fulfillment to bring unity to all things in heaven and on earth and the Christ in him we were also chosen heaven being destined according to the plans of him for our everything in conformity with the purpose of his word. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord
helping and comprehending the purpose of this study. In order, uh, in order that we who read the first report are hoping that
who were the first to put our foot in France might be might be for the praise of this world. And the also When you believe, you were marked in him with the seed 
the promised Holy Spirit, who is a deposit guaranteeing our inheritance until the redemption of those who are God's possession to the praise of His glory. This is the word of God. Thank you for everyone. I'm Deborah from St. George's Church. Now I'm going to recite the Bible, Ephesians chapter 1, verse 2 to 14. Ephesians chapter 1, verses 2 to 14. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in the heavenly realms with every spiritual blessing in Christ. For He chose us in Him before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless in His sight. In love, He predestined us for adoption to sonship through Jesus Christ to the, in accordance with His pleasure and will of his glorious grace that he has freely given us in the one he likes. In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the riches of God's grace that he lavished on us. With all wisdom and understanding, he made known to us the mystery of his will according to his good pleasure, which he purposed in Christ to be put into comfort one the times we to bring unity to all things in heaven and on earth and in Christ. In Him, we were also chosen, having been predestined according to the plan of Him, who works out everything in conformity with the powers of this world, in order that we, who were the first to put our hope in Christ, might be for the praise of His glory. And you also were included when you heard the message of truth your salvation. When you believe, you are marked in Him with the seed, the promised Holy Spirit, who is a deposit guaranteeing our inheritance until the redemption of those who are God's position to the praise of His glory. And this is the words of God. Thank you very much for being a I like to pay my respect to Joe Person, Honorable John Josh, and all the audience. I'm from Christ the King Church in Saint. Now I'm going to recite Ephesians chapter 1 verses 2 to 14. Ephesians chapter 1 verses 2 to 14. Ephesians chapter 1 verses 2 to 14. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in the heavenly realms with every spiritual blessing in Christ. For He told us in Him before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless in His sight. He predestined us for adoption to sonship through Jesus Christ in accordance. 
Get by God. He is a God of more than enough and overflow God. And it's really 